What's up, guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my DFS picks for NBA Thursday, January 16th. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. In this video, I'm gonna go over my top picks for today's NBA slate. And if you stick around to the very end of this video, we'll use the draft dashboard tools to make a DFS lineup using the picks we just made. Hey guys, our cash game lineup optimizer is now live. Playing cash games is the secret to building your bankroll. So that's why we've created our cash game lineup optimizer that will generate a lineup based on the highest projected ownership. In cash game lineups, you want safer plays that carry less risk and are owned by a larger percentage of the field. By using the wisdom of the crowd, we will generate a cash game lineup based on ownership projections. This new tool is available right now, so come on in and start building your bankroll. Okay, who do we have at the point guard position? I like Markel Fultz from the Orlando Magic playing the LA Clippers, who have a middle of the pack defense overall and their middle of the pack defending opposing point guards. Markel Fultz has averaged 25.1 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 27 minutes per game with a 22% usage rate. He's played 33, 31, and 30 minutes in the last three games. He scored 54 fantasy points last game. He's projected at 27.2 fantasy points here tonight. That's just about five times value. He's 5,500 DraftKings salary and the same price on FanDuel. So I like Markel Fultz here versus the LA Clippers. Okay, who do we have at the shooting guard position? I like Jordan Clarkson from the Utah Jazz playing the New Orleans Pelicans who have the third worst defense overall and they give up the second most fantasy points to opposing shooting guards. Jordan Clarkson has averaged 22.9 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 24 minutes per game with a 26% usage rate. He's projected at 24.4 fantasy points here tonight. On DraftKings, that's only 4.7 times value, but, he's, but that's much higher on FanDuel. He's projected at 4.7 times value, but that's on DraftKings. His price is much lower on FanDuel. He's 5,200 DraftKings salary and 900 less on FanDuel. So this is more of a FanDuel play for me. Vegas thinks there's gonna be 227.5 points scored in this game. It's a fast paced game and a fantastic matchup. So I like Jordan Clarkson here versus the New Orleans Pelicans. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you wanna enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Okay, who do we have at the small forward position? I like Gordon Hayward from the Boston Celtics playing the Milwaukee Bucks, who have a middle of the pack defense overall, and they're middle of the pack defending opposing small forwards. Gordon Hayward has averaged 32.5 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 32 minutes per game with a 21% usage rate. He's projected at 32.3 fantasy points here tonight. That's five times value. He's 6,400 DraftKings salary and 600 less on FanDuel. So I love that FanDuel price. Vegas thinks there's going to be 223.5 points scored in this game. It's a fast-paced game, and there's a couple players that are injured over there in Boston, so Gordon Hayward should get the majority of the work here. So I like Gordon Hayward here versus the Milwaukee Bucks. Okay, guys, if you're getting any value from this video, please hit that red subscribe button. We put out new fantasy basketball videos every single day. 
So if you hit that subscribe button and ring that bell notification, you won't miss out on any of our new fantasy basketball and fantasy football videos. Tons of free stuff coming your way. It only takes a second and it helps us push out more fantasy content for you guys to consume each and every day. It's because of you subscribers that make this possible. So thank you for supporting this channel. Okay, let's take a look at the power forward position. I'm gonna give you a value play here. This is a risky play, but I think he's gonna work out. I like Jermichael Green from the LA Clippers playing the Orlando Magic, who have a good defense overall, but they're middle of the pack defending opposing power forwards. Jermichael Green has averaged 17.8 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 21 minutes per game with a 14% usage rate. He's projected at 18.5 fantasy points here tonight. That's 5.3 times value. He's only 3,500 DraftKings salary and 100 more on FanDuel. Vegas thinks there's going to be 216.5 points scored in this game. It's a home game, a fast-paced game. So this guy's going to offer you great salary relief. So I like Jamichael Green here versus the Orlando Magic. Real quick, guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30-day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all of our DFS tools for all sports. You can try the position optimizer where you can see the top players ranked for each position. And we added a new player trends tool where you can see the top salary differences between FanDuel and DraftKings. It's a really good tool to help you pick out value for the site that you're playing on. Oh, and if you're tired of doing research every day, we just added a cheat sheet that shows hand-picked plays for the slate. No confusing stat lines, no headaches, just a simple cheat sheet that shows the absolute best players for your lineups. Okay, moving on to the center position. I like DeAndre Ayton from the Phoenix Suns playing the New York Knicks, who have the 11th worst defense overall, and they're middle of the pack defending opposing centers. DeAndre Ayton has averaged 36.7 fantasy points per game on the season, playing an average of 31 minutes per game with a 23% usage rate. He's projected at 37.4 fantasy points here tonight. That's just about five times value. He's 7,700 DraftKings salary and 300 less on FanDuel. Vegas thinks there's going to be 225.5 points scored in this game. It's a fast-paced game and a decent matchup. So I like DeAndre Ayton here versus the New York Knicks. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smiggity smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for this NBA slate. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck. Do you want more fantasy picks? Check out the video linked right in the middle of the screen. If you got any value from this video, please tap that subscribe button before you get out of here and ring that bell notification so you won't miss our daily fantasy football uploads. We're putting out new videos every day, so I don't want you guys to miss any of our free content.